My book is The Thief Lord by Cornelia Funk, and this book is really mysterious in many ways. First of all, there's a shallow boy in the background. You don't know who he is or what he's doing. It raises questions like, who is this boy? What is he doing? Is he the bad guy? Also, the cover is mysterious because it takes place at night, not day. What is special in this book that includes nighttime? The author also makes the cover look appealing. One way is the colors. There are blues and purples. Blues and purples are not bright colors but the colors are appealing if looked at closely. Why is the cover so grim, so dark? The author did want to make this mysterious, of course, but why should it be mysterious? It was autumn in Venice when Victor first heard of Prosper and Beau. For the first sentence, I had some questions such as, Who's Prosper? Who's Beau? And who the heck is Victor? Where is Victor in the story? Is he the main character? And so on. Also, the tone for this is mysterious. I didn't know what was happening in the book yet, and I wanted to find out. Clients, last, why are they bothering him now of all times? In addition to the first sentence, I also had an inner voice conversation in the paragraph. Some questions that I had are the following. Who are the clients? What is the person's occupation? What is he doing, and so on. Also, the tone was angry, because the person said blast in an angry way. These are the inner voice conversations that I had for the paragraph. In the first chapter of the book, The Thief Lord had an inner voice conversation. First of all, a detective named Victor is interviewing these two people that apparently have missing children. The missing children are Prosper and Beau. I was wondering who is Beau and Prosper. I also know that the people are in Venice. These people think the missing children ran there. The tone for this first chapter is grim and irritated. I think this because the people are frustrated that these two boys ran away. Also, the tone is grim because they don't know where the kids are at the moment. A metaphor for this is my flash drive. I didn't know where it was, and I was irritated because I had to save some of my homework on it. I was feeling very grim because I found it in my washing machine after it went through the rinse cycle. Now this is like Prosper and Bo, because the people are looking for them, are not sure where they are. The two are missing. That was my inner voice conversation that I had for the first chapter in The Thief Lord. Now that you have heard my IVCs, you'll see that Cornelia Funk does a really good job of making me create good questions. Also, she expresses many tones, and that is the reason why I decided to read her book, The Thief Lord.